guys, today I have a little bit of a different kind of video for you. Um, it's just a freshman advice, freshman in high school advice video because I'm going to be a sophomore and I've just been like reflecting on my year lately and I've just been thinking about all the things that I kind of would have wanted to know. So I decided to make that video and yeah, so I'm just going to get into it. I'll make a super long intro about it. But um, the first thing is it's high school. Like, it's normal to be excited, it's normal to be nervous, it's normal to wonder what your whole year is going to be like, um, but just get excited because it's fun. Don't, you know, I know a lot of people are excited about leaving their middle school and nervous about going into high school at the same time, and that is so, that's how I was at least. I was happy to leave my small little middle school because the high school that I went to had like 3,000 kids in it, but... Um, I was also nervous because it had 3,000 kids in it and I came from a school that had a total of like 200. So that's quite a change. <laughs> um, but like if you have to ask like an upperclassman or a sophomore or someone where you're going because you're like me and you missed your orientation, don't get super nervous about that. Like people want to help you out and they're going to mm -hmm. like just, they're going to help you out. So there's absolutely no reason to be nervous about that kind of stuff and there's no reason to be worried about people picking on you because you're a freshman like I didn't get any of that and I was that freshman that I had every right to be picked on it's okay I made it through um, the next thing is about your friends you're gonna make so many new friends in high school and just be open to that you know just be open to every single person you meet because you never know if you're going to become great friends with them or not. You know, even if they, even if you don't think you will, you might be. Because I made one of my best friends and I didn't think that I was going to be friends with her at all on my first day of school. Um, you know, you're also going to lose a lot of friends that you might have had in middle school or something. You might have been close to them in school, but if they're going to a different high school where you just weren't that close to them, they just you might just lose them as a friend. It's it's not really something to get super upset about. It's just, you know, it's just something that happens. So also watch friends that you thought you were super close with just completely change because everyone changes in high school. Everyone does. No one's exactly the same as they were the year before. And it's so strange to see how a year can totally, or even a couple months, can just change somebody so differently. I grew up so much in high school and I um, I just got a lot more comfortable in my own skin and I got a lot of confidence in high school just because you know seeing how many different types of people there were in my school made me just realize that it's totally fine to just be myself because there are people who will just accept me for me and that it's good to be weird like there's no reason to be like, not okay with your weirdness <laughs> Um, and you'll also watch a lot of your friends change too, and it's, you know, and you change with them, and it's kind of cool, and sometimes you'll grow apart, and sometimes you'll grow cro closer. The next thing that I wanted to say about, or talk about, was, um, like drugs and alcohol. You will see that in high school. I didn't see it at all in middle school. My school was so small, and even if it was going on, like, I was completely oblivious. Like, I didn't know at all, but in high school, you will see it for sure. You'll see some of your friends try to try it out and do it, and, like, you know, I myself am such, like, no. I'm, I'm so, like, straight. Like, I don't have a problem with people doing it around me. I just, I just don't personally want to do it. But you will see it in high school, and if you didn't see it in middle school, you will definitely see it in high school. And I just wanted to put that out there. Um, also, what your parents say, a lot of what they say is true. And, you know, I went into high school and my mom was like, okay, so, you know, you might be friends with these types of girls, and you're going to meet people from this town that you really like. I bet some people from this town you might not be the closest friends with, um, because, you know, a lot of towns go to one high school where I live. Um, and my mom was 100% right. Everything that she told me going to high school, she was right on. So listen to your parents, even if you think they're wrong, just listen to them a little bit. You know, they're probably right. Um, the next one. This one was, is very important in my mind. It's, it's the boy department. Um, the first thing that I want to say is that it is 100% completely normal 
for a freshman to date a sophomore or junior if anybody's wondering going into high school. 100% normal. So, um, high school relationships, I can make a whole video on that because I have a very strong opinion, but I don't, I didn't have a boyfriend my whole freshman year because I don't want one. I still don't want one because how long are they really going to last? But that is a totally different video and, but, you know, I want more boy experiences in high school than I did in middle school. I had middle school, I just like liked boys and I just... But, you know, high school was kind of the year that I had my first kiss and, like, stuff like that. So, yeah, boys are kind of a big deal in freshman year. Um, and then the last thing, I think I already covered this, is just be yourself because you will have so much more fun if you're just yourself. And it's not that, like, and you will meet people who will totally understand who you are. And um, that's one of the really cool things about high school is kind of trying to figure out who you are and just finding out who yourself even is, and so, yeah, just be yourself, have fun. That's like all I have to say about high school so far. Um, yeah, go in being positive and just get excited for it because it's an exciting time.